So you wanna take your wedding day detail photos to the next level? Well, today I'm sharing three items that you can bring with you on a wedding day to make that happen. Welcome back to the channel. I'm Josiah Blizzard, so glad you're here. Please, before you watch this video, just, just hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. A lot of you who are watching these videos, I realized aren't even subscribed to the channel. I have a lot of great content coming your way in 2021. But today, we are still talking about photography, specifically wedding photography and getting some really awesome detail photos. Now, why do detail photos matter? Well, the bride probably spent a lot of money on these. They spent a lot of time. They love, they love the ring that their uh, new husband got them. Uh, and they love the work that has been put into this. A lot of the details end up encapsulating the uh, really the vibe, the mood, the tone of the whole day, uh, especially for us. And they look great at the beginning of a blog post and it feels very high end editorial and will make your work look much more expensive than it probably is. So that is why we suggest photographing those details. Are they the most important thing on the day? Absolutely not. But they are still important to the overall telling of the story and from our perspective anyway. So that is why we suggest getting detail photos done. But there are a few things that we bring, and we actually bring more than a few things, but I'm breaking it down today into three items that you should bring with you on the wedding day. Take your detail photos to the next level. The first thing that you should bring, a ring box or multiple ring boxes, preferably in different colors. Now you can get these ring boxes all over the internet, whether it's from Etsy or where we got ours from, themrsbox.com. And that is a very expensive site, but they are known for their ring boxes, especially in the wedding industry. So check out that website. I've linked it in the description below. And I've linked a few other ring boxes from Etsy that you could purchase. Bringing these with you will really up the, the quality, the um, editorial feel, the, the high-end feel uh, for these detail photos. I've only ever had, I think, two or three brides give us their own ring box on the day. And I'm not talking about one of those flip up ones that look really cheap and, and not that great. I'm talking about like a legit ring box that looks beautiful and is like, it, it is a ring box, like it's high end looking. So we've only ever had two or three brides give that to us on the day. Otherwise we're using our own. So we have a pack of five that we bring, a bunch of different colors and we've picked um, colors that are classic and neutral and will really fit with every single wedding. So check out the links in the description and purchase a ring box or two for your own weddings. The next thing that we bring is some ribbon. And again, we have ribbon in multiple different colors, but we use this ribbon to make this again, feel more high end, more editorial. And it is normally something that, this is something that Steph does. Steph shoots all the detail photos, but uh, she kind of weaves it in and out as like a textured under layer underneath all of the invitations and the, and the ring boxes and the shoes and all those things. It's kind of just this splash of color that goes over top of the styling mats that we use. And that brings me to my next item that you should bring with you, styling mats. It's not a bad idea to grab a styling mat or two. You can purchase the ones we use from kiss.us. And uh, those are the ones that we use. They're really awesome. They roll up into a small tube and uh, you can carry them with you. They're really lightweight and they don't wrinkle or anything uh, of that sort. So those are the three items that you should bring with you. A little bonus item if you want, bring some little small knickknacks with you. It could be some stamps. We use vintage stamps all the time and uh, you could even get some gold scissors or you could get um, a foil, uh, is it called a foil press or a, um, I don't know what it's called. Don't know what it's called. It, oh, a wax seal. That's what it's called. It's called a wax seal. I'm not from the 1800s, so I don't use those. But you could bring those. Those look great in detail photos as well. So those are the items you should bring. Hope this was helpful, guys. Up your photo game, up your wedding day detail game in 2021. Crush those details. If you haven't checked out the last video I released, it was about getting uh, awesome ring photos. So there's some tips there. I've linked it in the cards above and in the description below. So check that out as well. If you enjoyed this video, please share it with a friend and please hit that like button. It does make a difference. And if you have any questions, leave it in the comments. I'd love to answer any questions you have and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you in the next video. Take care.